In this video, we're going to look at some of the ways the NEC SL Desktop Suite will make you more productive. If you're an Outlook user, there's no better way to demonstrate how you can be more productive than to show you how the NEC SL Desktop Suite with Outlook and your telephone interact. Here's an incoming call from Randy at Northwoods Products. If the caller ID of an incoming call is matched in an Outlook contact record, you'll get a screen pop before you even answer the phone. Imagine getting this much information about your caller before you even answer the telephone. But it doesn't stop there. Let's say you need to transfer that caller to another person. How about if we do it right out of Outlook? Highlight your Outlook contact and either right click for your transfer options or press this button that has been added to your toolbar. Choose between any number in the contact record. I'm going to choose Morgan's extension. Hi Morgan, I have Randy from Northwoods Products on the phone. Would you like to take his call? Great, here he is. What if you're not on a call, but just want to call one of your Outlook contacts? The procedure to initiate a call is the same as the transfer we just did. How about calling someone that sent you an email? Just highlight their phone number in their email signature and send it to the NEC SL desktop dialer and press start. You can do this out of a Word document, PDF, or an Excel spreadsheet. As a matter of fact, virtually any number you can highlight in Windows can be dialed. Let's say you just got out of a lead sharing meeting and someone gave you a list of potential people to contact about your service. Just open it, highlight the number, and send it to the dialer. If you call someone frequently and don't always want to dial them out of Outlook, you can add them as a speed dial button. Now you can just dial them right out of your NEC SL desktop suite. If you have several numbers associated with a contact, you can access those numbers by right-clicking the contact button. That's a lot of ways to call someone. Let's look at some of the options for handling incoming calls with the NEC SL Desktop Suite. When an incoming call arrives, it appears here in this open area of the application. I can mouse click to answer it like this or I could have pressed the answer tool button or the F1 key. Last but not least I could have answered my phone the way I have for years by picking up the handset. The caller will appear here as my active call no matter how I choose to answer it. Let's say I want to transfer this call to Morgan. All I have to do is drag it onto Morgan's BLF button and release it. Since I have my client set up for supervised transfer, I have the ability to introduce the caller and either transfer it or drop Morgan off the call and go back to the original caller. Hi Morgan, I have a call for you. Would you like to take it? Great. Right mouse clicking on a BLF brings up a host of other options. For example, I could send a caller directly into Morgan's voicemail. I could transfer either supervised or immediate. I could send the caller to Morgan's mobile phone or her home phone. This list can be expanded in the contact directory and you can have almost an unlimited number of alternate transfer numbers. Or I could set up a conference call. Let's do that. Hi Morgan, I have Acme Widgets on the line 
and I'd like you to get on, on this conference call. Great, thank you. Another right mouse click feature is the ability to quickly send somebody an email. Well, let's move on to the toolbar. Instead of remembering confusing codes or needing precious button space on your telephone, you can assign telephone features to the toolbar. For example, I can easily access the paging system for internal or external paging. Or let's say I'm going to be working in Morgan's office today. I can easily forward my telephone to her extension. The NEC SL Desktop Suite is very flexible and each user can customize it to best fit their needs. I hope these examples give you an idea of how it can help you be more productive. Thank you for watching this video.